Hey guys, Shinloxy here, back with our blind playthrough of Deus Ex. Alright. So I hope I'm a little bit more awake now. That last episode I did record uh, a couple hours ago. So now... Right, we just talked to him, and that was... One more thing before I go, since you've been briefed on my augmentations. What can you tell me about the info link? Let's see, micro receiver exostructure in the sulci, mechanocarbon threads on the axons. For queuing, you know, packet routing. Anything particularly interest you? Is there a way to turn it off? The info link? Yeah, or is someone at UNATCO tuned in 24 hours? These might sound a little funny, JC, but I'm not permitted to answer that question. Your clearance is higher than mine? Regarding your systems, I am your physician. No big deal. I was just curious. That is kind of a big deal. So, Ghost in the Shell. I don't know if you guys have ever watched it. The, the Carter's out the door and around the corner. He's got your stealth pistol. All right. The um, standalone complex. They bring up that uh, the major and is it Bateau? The two, the two main characters. Makoto Kusanagi, and then the dude with, like, the eyes. The little cylinders. Uh, what is it? Their bodies have been so replaced with hardware that they're basically owned by the company that they work for. Like, so they can't quit because they wouldn't have anything left. Because when the company's like, okay, we'll turn in your, your body. So it's kind of a like similarities to this. Now, what I would like to do, well, first there's the augmentation. Ah, eh, heal one point at a time. All right, so what is this? This one specifically is micro muscle, microfibril muscle or combat strength. Uh, let's see. Muscle strength is amplified with ionic polymeric gel myofibrils that allow the agent to push and lift extraordinarily heavy objects. Tech 1 strength increased slightly, increased moderately. What is this tech level? Do you have multiple augmentations? Or multiple levels, I guess? So this would allow... Probably a bit more, um, I don't know what you call it, like flexibility in uh, going through different areas, right? And then there's this, which is combat strength. Sorting rotos accelerate calcium ion concentration in the sarcoplasmic reticulum, increasing an agent's muscle speed several fold and multiplying the damage they inflict in melee combat. So melee damage increase or energy rate 20 units per minute I'm probably gonna go with this because if there's like a like a giant box covering up a like an air duct or something I could just move that out of the way and sneak inside I'm not I'm thinking of not necessarily being a combat person as much as a like stealth pistol Person. So we'll install this. Boom. F6. So that's how you turn it on, I suppose. Oh, I'm out of, um... Oh, right, I'm out of bioelectric energy, aren't I? Because it got used. Well. Why can I not heal? Oh, there you go. Ah, well, let's do this. Oh, heal all. Boom. Yay! I feel good. Alright, where are we going now? And why can I not... I guess I could just drop stuff to get the pistol. What I'd also like to do, I think... Uh, let's see, can I pick up multiple... Oh wait, I have a spot now. Maybe we'll go get the pistol as well. Does this, uh, does this take two slots? I bet they don't stack. Uh, 
what I would like to see... Okay, the Nightingale Medical Bot. Why does this... Why is this in the notes? G. Herman password to Zeitgeist. So G. Herman. G. Her... Herman. Zeitgeist. Okay. That works. From J. Manderly, Reese Skullgun. Let's see. I've personally forwarded your request to appropriations. Upgrading our combat readiness is an ongoing priority. Speaking of which, you certainly made the best of a difficult situation yesterday. We applaud your courage. Thank you for living to work another day, Gunther. We need more agents like you. Might I suggest again a skull gun for my head? Yesterday in Battery Park, some scum we all know pushes smack for NSF, gets jumpy, and draws. I take two 22s, one in flesh, one in augs, before I can get out that damn assault gun. If I got just killed by thought, it would be better. Is it my job to be human target practice backstop? Yeah. Yeah, this guy's like a career, career military. He's like, he's all in. He is sacrificing everything for the mission. But he's a hothead. Uh, forward to you. Yep, I got that one too. Yep, A. Navarre, J. C. Denton. Let's see, J.C. Denton will be joining us today after his stint at the Academy, and I'm assigning both of you to keep the task... to the task... Both of you, the task of keeping a watchful eye on him while monitoring his progress. His assigned cover name for the duration of his service will be J.C. Denton. We thought it would be best to keep the cover names within the family since Paul has already received the Denton code name. There we go. I have great faith in you both, and I trust you will do your utmost to ensure that he becomes a successful and productive member of this organization. Until further notice, I'd like to receive weekly reports with your observations. Log out. Now, additionally, I would actually, just me personally, while they're doing the nano stuff, I would assume that, you know, nano augmentation of flesh can only go so far, presumably, you know, once you develop, like, stronger mechanical stuff, you could probably... I would imagine the... Um, what is it? Potential. The potential for the mechanical augmentations is far greater. I I don't know. I understand they're probably going to get phased out. In in this universe, the nano stuff is is better. It's, like, more of a super soldier rather than a robot. But... Just realistically, it seems like cyborg stuff would be better. At least long term. Okay, Manderly. Uh, so it's login is still J Manderly Night Killer. Let's check his email too. Interestingly enough, we can access it from anywhere. Uh, J Manderly. See, I wish we could pull up our actual thing from here. Night killer. Can I hit enter? Yes, I can. WS, our little experiment. Should be arriving soon. Clear it for Domination 5F Ops as soon as possible, but proceed with caution. We have serious concerns about the primary unit and would like to avoid any potential contamination. 2J Manderly and A. Navara. I assume... Denton, or J.C. Denton's the experiment, right? He's probably the secondary and Paul being the primary, I guess? It's hard to say. Okay, A. Navarre. I don't think we've gotten her login. Anyway, ooh, that's weird. Okay, uh, let's see... Uh, well, okay. Yeah, don't have her stuff. It might be worth it to hack in and see if I can access her email. Now this also doesn't require uh, bioelectric energy. 
which is nice. Okay, where J Manderley, J C D, J Reyes. Oh, change account. Who's Jacobson? Uh, well, I can't. I doubt it's gonna say her stuff anywhere in there. Oh, F6, F12, okay. Can I even activate that? Bioelectric energy reserves depleted. So, no. All right. Hey, do you have a... I am not going to hold your hand. You have your orders. Can I uh, get your password and log in and stuff? Well, let's see if we can talk so to him. So let's see. A stealth pistol and what else do you think you'll need? A smart lockpick is always handy. Can you spare a nanotech tech tool? Lockpick versus hacking, I assume. Or ammo. I would assume one of these would probably be better. Let's do the lockpick. A smart lockpick is always handy. That's right. Infiltrate and evade. Engage only on your own terms. Now move out. Manderley's waiting. Hey, what about that guy out front selling munitions? Is that allowed? Oh, Captain, right. We've got some screwballs around here, but he's not the problem. It's whoever's been breaking into the armory. Someone at Unaco's a thief? Yes, sir. And a damn good one. Hmm. Secondary goal completed. Goal received. Check. Whatever. Hmm. The whiskey's not bad, it's Japanese whiskey, it's plum flavored. Which is a little odd, but it's it's too sweet. So there's the stealth pistol. Uh let's see. Oh, base accuracy. Right. The stealth pistol is a variant of the standard 10mm pistol with a larger clip and integrated silencer designed for wet work at very close ranges. Yeah, we discovered that with the dart. With a combination of high stopping power, blah, blah, blah. What, how does that compare to the regular pistol? Base damage, 14. Lower base damage. That would actually make sense because of the silencer. Well, now that we have the stealth pistol, though, might be worth putting some of these mods on. Weapon modification accuracy. Mmm. And a prototype plasma gun. Clip extend. Well, this might actually be really good, just overall. I don't know if we're going to get any sort of an upgrade to it. I can't see getting, like, you know, 10 millimeter pistol version 2 or whatever. It's probably like, this is probably the only one you're going to get. You know, rocket launchers, a couple different rifles, couple different pistols, you know, that sort of thing. So let's... I mean, we have this stuff. We may as well use it. You know, we can't carry it around forever. Okay. How many mods can we put on this thing? And where does it say? 10 rounds plus 10%, 11? Really? Oh, six. It was six before, presumably. What is this? One round? Oh. Wow, really? Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think I looked at this. EMP grenade creates a localized pulse that will temporarily disable all electronics within its area of effect, including cameras and security grids. There we go. Unaco Ops file note. While nanotech augmentations are largely unaffected by EMP, experiments have shown that it will cause the spontaneous dissipation of stored bioelectric energy. Also good to know.
Okay. Laser sight, yes. Scope, no. Silencer, not available. Well, I mean, it's silenced. Okay, and what about this? Accuracy? Yeah, why not? Let's just put everything on the stealth pistol. Plus 9% instead of 5, so, you know. That's good. And this must be the smart lockpick. Right, fast congealing polymers. Hmm. Okay. NSF are in retreat. You better get going. Can I get more stuff? Also, well, we don't know anything about the Where's the armory? I mean, there's got to be somewhere because they were, you Zimanderly know. Zimanderly on level two, and let's move out. All right. One moment. Way to go, sir. Oh, thanks, buddy. I don't know who you are, but thank you. You're a random trooper. Yeah, so I was watching some of my. I have to prepare for the mission. You know, previous stuff. Maybe you can't even sell anything. Oh man, even the, the coat even moves as, as we move. Oh, and there's a pack of cigarettes right there. If you want to lose health. Um, but I was watching some of my older stuff. Or, you know, even like the first episode of this. And I do talk a lot. I know that I do. It's just something I have to work on. Who is that? Oh, that's got to be Paul. It's, uh... You know, it's not... Oh, thanks. This isn't it, is it? Ah, uh, still takes two lock picks. Should I... Should I just pick that lock? Should I upgrade? Around. Should I upgrade my lockpick and grab what is it? Darts and I don't know what that other one is. Netco HQ. Yes. All right. Well, let's upgrade lock picking. Uh, efficiency just increases slightly. Boom. One level. Hmm. Demolition presumably is the gap gun, right? No. Uh, would it be heavy weapons? Yes. Accuracy is low. Movement is difficult. Mm. Well. What's all those... Wait, were those dots on there before? Ah, see, now it only takes one pick. Lock is picked. Tranquilizer darts. Flare darts. What do flare darts do? Uh, let's see. Mini crossbow flare darts use a slow burning incendiary device ignited on impact to provide illumination of a targeted area. Pepper cartridge. Better blind than dead. So they probably just blind them. I mean, obviously, right? But they probably don't knock them out. We'll have to, you know, we'll have to use the mini crossbow more, I think, as well. All right, well, level two. <clears throat> Excuse me.
Yeah, so I don't know how long it'll take to fix the my rambling issue, but hopefully... I don't know, I'm not going to worry about it too much. I just need to... Just need to work on it, you know? That will be JC's job. What's that? Power station. The NSF have Ambrosia in a warehouse protected by cameras and booby traps. We want to power down the whole system. We're taking one illicit generating plant, protected by weak groups of NSF. Knock out that plant, and Paul's team can walk right into the warehouse. Just tell me where it is. The NSF are openly resisting our deployed forces, gradually falling back. You'll have to deal with them first. And you be ready, Paul. When the power drops, go in and go in hard. I'll use my discretion. Go in like the U.S. Marshals. We lose the vaccine, I'm sending your butt to the mayor to explain why he and his three daughters won't get their pills this month. Yes, sir. Let's not waste any time, JC. Get down to the dock. A boat is waiting to take you and your partner, Anna Navarro, to shore. Yes, get moving. Here's your op bonus for the great job you did in the statue, plus 250 for rescuing Agent Herman. That's 1250. We take care of our people around here. Thank you, sir. By the way, Denton, stay out of the ladies' restroom. That kind of activity embarrasses the agency more than it does you. Well, all right. Okay, I gotta click on this thing. No new messages. Weird. You'll come to admire your partner. She's one of our best. Indeed. Okay, so the restroom does, you know, but that was, uh, what they were talking about was the money, right? 1250 and then an extra 250. So an extra 1500. That makes sense. I was hoping it was skill points, to be honest, but, uh, yeah, that's not, <sighs> it's not going to happen. I guess the next thing that I would want to upgrade would be maybe electronics? Or maybe the heavy, so I can use that GEP gun. Eight rounds. As I mean, it's laser guided, so that should be okay. That should be relati relatively. Leave from where you arrived, Denton. The boat dock. Move it. Yeah. How do I recharge my energy? There's an energy recharge thing somewhere, right? The only thing that I saw that was kind of like that was... That was a close one up there. Um... In the supply area, right? A pistol is more than adequate. Hell, I dispatched a whole platoon one time with a pocket knife. It's locked, but it's infinitely strong. <coughs> well... Well then. Oh. There's a mod in there. <sighs> I... Is it accuracy? I don't... Honestly, know if it's worth using one lockpick to get in here. It only takes one, though, so maybe it is worth it. Accuracy. I wonder if it can be applied multiple times. Uh, yeah, wait. Okay. U.S. President sells out 
President Philip Riley Meade's executive order repaying the United States debt to the United Nations is viewed by many as a positive step towards global peace, but others sense darker motives at work. Some sources have privately commented that the order is nothing more than a tacit endorsement of a new world government and its private military, the United Nations Anti-Terrorist Coalition, UNATCO. Few can forget Meade's impassioned declaration that the shattered Statue of Liberty would not be repaired, but instead stand as a reminder that terrorism, ah, terrorism must be eradicated if we are to be free. It was shortly thereafter that Liberty Island was selected as the location of UNATCO headquarters, their dubious charter highlighted by the mysterious and largely still unexplained circumstances behind the statue bombing. No doubt President Meade's words will be remembered, even as he sells out his country to the foreign powers that have sought to destroy it for nearly three centuries. Joe Green, Senior Staff Writer. Commissioner Pravenel, Data Links. Well. Oh, I just hit the I button that brings up the inventory. So. Let's see if we can use multiples. So it's plus nine right now. Yes, but it looks like, no, I was gonna say diminishing returns, but it's about four each time. So stealth pistol seems to be where it's at. Okay. Beep. Wish I was going with you. Do you? Do you? Saving loading. All right. Good luck out there. Man, two dens in the field. The NSF won't know what hit them. Thanks, man. Should I take the candy bar? Nah. Okay, we're, uh, right, we're taking the boat. Should I buy anything? Nah. Just... Oh. Now I was hoping to... Check out stuff. Did I, um... Oh. I just want to make sure there's nothing that I missed. Good luck, Agent. Oh, thanks, man. Found a body. Wait, did that always have blood under it like that? I don't think it did. Anyway... I'm glad I move. I don't know how to. I don't know how to restore my uh, bioelectric energy. You know what? Let me run around to the back of the Statue of Liberty again. I just want to make sure that one of those things was not a uh, a recharging station. Like I don't remember seeing any. I remember just the med bot, but but you never know. Hmm. I mean, that puts a real damper on stuff if there's no way to, uh... I mean, I know you can recharge it, but if, uh... Hmm. Huh. Right, it was somewhere here. Okay, what is this? Medical bot. Just a medical bot. Uh, okay. No. What about down here? I know we still have the hazmat suit. Right. Crowbar. Hmm. I 
Well, I mean, it is a... What? Can I eat the rat? I'm kidding. Hmm. I mean, it's the beginning area. You'd think there'd be a way. What's with the boxes of TNT? Well, she's still there. That DNSF won't try that trick again. What trick? Sure you can't buy some ammo? 10 millimeter clip. Give you 50 for the darts. Uh... Yeah, why not? Let's buy the darts. I'll give you 50 for the darts. Thanks. She's... she's beaten up. I don't even know how many darts that was. Probably just like six. Still, that's potentially six people I could take down. Yeah, they must have taken all the ammo and rifles and stuff like that and given them to the quartermaster, like they said before. And... Well then. Yep, and if you didn't get any of the stuff, I guess this would be the time to do it. You can't get anything from the dead bodies, though. You missed your chance. Unatco HQ, Liberty Island. Can you imagine if we have to go up against those things? I'm sure we will, at some point. My suspicions for this is probably that... I mean, I know the government's secretly evil and stuff, but probably Unatco as well. And, uh, you know, we'll probably have to come back here and storm the place or whatever. Uneko boat pilot. Let's head out. All right, let's go. The terrorists are in a fighting retreat. A few have barricaded themselves inside Castle Clinton. Lead the way. Our orders are to locate a barrel of ambrosia they are hiding inside. I will give you a schematic of the barrel, but first we will exterminate the NSF terrorists. Exterminate? A precious opportunity we cannot neglect. What about the rest of the shipment? That is your brother's assignment. You will take the subway to meet him in Hill's Kitchen. But first, we should deal with Castle Clinton. Are we going in the front, or is there another way? A secondary entrance would be useful, but I am aware of no such thing. Hmm. <clears throat> Goal received. Alright, well first let's save. Uh, Battery Park. Battery Park. So about the Ambrosia. They call it a vaccine. But it sounds more like some sort of immunosuppressant drug, right? That you have to take on a monthly basis. Like you have to take it. It's a way they can get you addicted or control you. Like, hey, this thing's going to kill you if you don't take this, you know, antidote or something like that, right? Like it's, that's interesting. Yes. And let's see. Effective for 48 hours. 
Ambrosia is a non-organic compound containing eutactic components. What is eutactic? Administer only in verified cases of great death. Let's. I'm gonna look up what eutactic is. Ambrosia. Even the name is creepy. Right? It's like some sort of drug. I mean, it is. Maybe. Right? Okay. Uh. You. Tactic. You tactic. Uh. In mathematics, a eutactic, eutactic lattice is a lattice in Euclidean space whose minimal vectors form a eutactic star. That's helpful. I'm not going to scroll down anymore because I worry that it'll be like, Oh, Deus Sex, yeah, that's Ambrosia. Ambrosia is the whatever. Conversations. Right on. Okay, locate... This is the secondary goal. Locate the stolen barrel of Ambrosia. So she's run off. What is this? Okay. What's up, kid? I'm starving. Do you have anything to eat? All I have is a candy bar. Don't matter. I just need something in my stomach so I can fall asleep. Here you go. Do you have a place to stay? I sleep out on the dock where they unload the speedboats. Speedboats? Is that how the NSF get their supplies? I don't know. They're always coming in and out of the tunnel behind the soda machine. Interesting. I spy on them from the crates. The code is 9183. Clever boy. Thanks for the snack, mister. It's the least I can do. Right on. This soda machine? Well, that would be what your strength augmentation's for, if I could, you know. Wait. That's a friendly person. Do I have a map of this area? No, I don't. But, uh, well, let's go this way. We're sure that's a friendly person? That must be the Castle Clinton. Look at that. Don't have nobody at the side entrance. NSF could just walk away. Agreed. So it's worth keeping chocolate in my pocket in case random children walk up and ask for food? I don't know. Will... let's see, can I... I can't use this, that's weird. Who is that? Okay, that is not an enemy. Hmm. Somebody kill me. Anybody? Oh, man. I'm sorry. I can't kill you. Please. Go to a public clinic. They can do something for the pain. It's true. It's your whole body. Every cell. You have the Grey Death. I can't make it. I just can't make it. Hmm. That's not good. Oh, what is what is going on here? Why are you bleeding? Where did he where did he come from? Well, there's another one. Is he bleeding as well? Oh. 
They're getting shot at. That's no good. Well. Oh, he sees me. Hey, buddy. Oh, no, no, no. That was the wrong button. Don't shoot me, please. There we go. Right on. And you have to right click on him. You can't just uh, left click. All right. Is this a sick man? Yeah. Yeah, that's that's pretty miserable. So where did... So is this Castle Clinton? That's... No, sir. Forget about the NSF. Most of those old forts have a bolt hole. Those boys will be long gone out of side tunnel by now. I mean, it makes sense. Okay, so we have some small little crates. Oh, hang on, we have, oh, like that. Right, see if I had energy, but I don't. Hmm, 762 ammo, which is, I mean, I guess there's an AK. Dude just has a knife? They've got hostages in the subway station. There is a subway station. We lost some of our men. That's not good. All right. Too heavy to lift. Hmm. Well, oh, okay, let's, well, you know, don't let me get in your way, officer. Oh, thanks, man. He sounds a little bit into his cups, though. I'm all right with that. Cardboard box. Why tiny little cardboard boxes, exactly? Okay, so we got a couple people. This is the front. Castle Clinton. Oh, there she is. How do I... We've got your back, Agent. She's just gonna wait for me to go inside, huh? That's annoying. They won't get far if they try to escape. The Ambrosia is somewhere inside the castle. So are those boobs robotic too? I mean, look at that. They're like torpedoes. They're like Madonna. From the 80s, I mean, not today. Oh, see, there is that entrance. More ammo. Twelve gauge buckshot shells, huh? Man, it's almost time to stop. Our country tis the sweet land of liberty of the icing. It's pretty good. Pretty good. That must be where the boat was. Sick woman, oh. Got five credits for someone who's got the great death. Yeah. Here you go. God bless you. Well, okay, so this is where we were before. This is where they got shot.
looks like uh, not a good little area. Looks like um, like homeless people. All right, so I right-clicked on him. He didn't give me anything, and then uh, oh, see, he didn't get anything there either. Oh, that's another dude. I need to do nice ooh okay ah subway station got it battery park Excuse me. I didn't see the laser pointer, though. I'll take the ammo. Uh, yield two points. Ah. Right leg has taken some damage. What is this? Oh, so you can go down. I mean that, oh, that's a ladder though. Man, this gnat is crazy. Yield two points, we'll do it. Is that something? Soy food. And what is this? Bioelectric cell. Oh, yeah, okay. I can't just eat. Okay, that was weird. So they have hostages in the subway station. I see. So is it worth... Is it worth going in here first? Because she was like, oh yeah, we need to clean that out, but it looks like they went into the subway. Don't turn around, don't turn around, don't see me. Something moved. Ah! Well, that was, yeah. Hmm. So there's this.
I only have one lockpick left. Med kit. Flare. I really wish I could see. The med kit alone might be worth it, but man, I want more lockpicks. Like, where can you buy them or get more of them? You know? Have I been in here before? Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, damn it. This one is locked too, isn't it? It's locked. I guess... I mean, we also have explosives. A knife. Hmm. I don't think we can just beat it, right? You have to use explosives on it? Yeah. Um... Let's try it. If it doesn't work, we'll stop. Yes. So we have these. Base accuracy, base damage 50. Okay. Um... Okay. Uh, you know. That's probably a good use of it. And a candy bar. Works for me. So... There's still that one back at the dock. May as well, you know? It just... It bounces more than you would think. What's up, kid? Do you have to be, you know, right there? Can you go somewhere else? Josh. That one's good. I'm glad, dude. Just go, go somewhere else. Because I don't want you to get hurt when I blow up this thing. Or I... Oh, no, we have to pick the lock. Well, in that case... It's locked. Please work. Yeah. Okay, that's what he's talking about. Conversations or notes? Yeah, secret tunnel behind the soda machine on the dock in Battery Park. Code 9183 possibly leads to the NSF hideout. Should I go into the castle first? I'm tempted. Was 9183, was that it? Well, looks like a dungeon in there. Oh, hey, buddy. The NSF seems to be falling back. That's what I would do. Let's, uh, let's stop here. Because the goal is just to find the Ambrosia, not to go into the... She says the goal is to exterminate them all. But that's not necessarily the actual goal. Battery park. 
Save game. This is interesting. I wish I had more lockpicks, though. All right, guys. Well, that is it for today. Thank you guys so much for your time and attention. I really do appreciate it. Make sure the kitties aren't around when I, when I wheel the chair back. So, I do appreciate your guys' time and attention. I really hope these episodes are uh, enjoyable for you guys. I know I do... I like to dig into stuff. I like to dig into the game. I like to read all the stuff. Um, for some people, that's going to be a real deal breaker. And that's okay. That I'm totally fine with. Um, if you don't like the playthrough, then you can always come back when I'm doing a different game. Or, I mean, I've done... This is like game number 34 or something. So I have different playthroughs for a variety of different games. If this is not quite to your taste, you can always come back. Um... On the other hand, if you do like this, then I think most of my other playthroughs are going to be similar to this. Just because, you know, like I said, I like to dig into into all the details. I like to read all the item descriptions. I like to read all the newspapers and books that are lying around. Um, that's, you know, the developers put their time into creating those little, those little lore pieces and, and the story and the background and the world. I just... You know, I want to I want to see what they did. Plus, I I'm curious about what's going on. Um, yeah. So, what is your guys' unique positive moment for today? I'm gonna work on the rambling too. It'll take time. It takes time to change oneself, but that's part of the reason I started the channel. Uh, so, for me, my unique positive moment is I ordered one of those um, the giant gummy bears. It's like a five pound gummy bear. It's big. pretty big uh good though i got blue raspberry so that's my unique positive moment hopefully your guys is just as good as mine hopefully better um and i hope to see you guys next time till then guys take care